Drake has consistently been ranked as one of the highest paid rappers in the world. The Canadian has now, a net worth estimated at around $260 million, allowing him to enjoy the big life. He ensures that he makes lavish purchases that suit his style, from expensive clothes, to supercars worth millions. The rapper also has a vast jewelry collection, from rare diamond necklaces, to diamond encrusted watches. A collection unlike any other. Today on the Celebrity Jewelry, let's look at the jewelry collection of Drake. Beginning with the chains, for Aubrey, nothing is off limits. Here are a few of his most far out pieces. Over the past couple of months, Drake has been photographed on countless occasions wearing the same necklace from Ocean's brand Homer. The chain comprises an iced out, diamond heavy pendant, which is attached to an equally bejeweled chain, which costs a whopping total of $1.9 million. Stone Island, is an Italian streetwear clothing brand. And Drake decided to custom a jewel representing the logo. The pendant consists of black, green and canary yellow diamonds set into an oversized replica of the Stone Island logo. The end result has an estimated value of $100,000. The Grammy-winning rapper has purchased a Lariat-style natural diamond necklace made of 42 large diamonds, inspired by the times he wanted to propose but didn't. Each gem represents a natural diamond engagement ring that could have been. The jaw-dropping necklace took 14 months to make, and features 42 natural diamonds of various shapes. Assuming Drake levels of quality in each diamond, the price tag for the necklace is easily $13 million. Drake has even two chains to honor the late Tupac Shakur. The chains feature the head of Tupac, mixed with elements of the customary Jesus piece. A blue bandana version uses white gold and diamonds, while the red bandana version sees natural yellow diamonds and yellow gold. The thorns, nose ring, tears, and earrings are all iced out. Priced at $300,000 per chain, both pieces took a total of five weeks to make. Furthermore, the boy splashed on a 100 carat piece that took so long to make, because it is hard to create diamonds in the shape of a heart, and this piece features a number of them. It was made by Gemma Fine Jewelry, and it costed him $1 million. After honoring Tupac, the Canadian artist came back with other accessories. Leading the set is a ski mask Cupid pendant, which is reportedly approximately $300,000 alone, with 75 carats of diamonds. Drake is also seen wearing a fully iced out, 1017 Alex 9SM. Hero chain with an edge-to-edge -edge setting of diamonds, valued at 200 grand. A chain that made a huge controversy, is this one. A 23-part necklace with all kinds of iced-out emojis. You can find a random sun, a tongue, a brain, a blood drop, a flower, you name it. The chain made by New York City Luxury, costed him a ridiculous $300,000. Lastly, Thugger commissioned a personal piece with a fully iced-out Cuban chain. The pendant itself sees a hefty gold OVO Allen bale completely covered in diamonds. Where this double-sided chain features a portrait of Drake and Adonis, the price of this piece is unknown. Moving on to the watches, nothing catches the eye quite like the rapper's Patek Philippe Nautilus, customized by designer Virgil Abloh. Toronto's favorite son has never hidden his love for outlandish timepieces, but this watch, which is covered in emeralds, takes things up a notch or two. It is also priced at a crazy $600,000. For even more luxury, Drake went for an Astronomia Casino, all four arms sit atop the highlight of the watch, a fully working roulette table that's complete with a ceramic ball. Priced at $620,000, this Jacob & Company Astronomia Casino is sure to separate Drake, from the plethora of Patek Philippe Nautilus watches worn by his peers. For a romantic touch, Drake's new watch in question is a Richard Miller M69 Erotic Tourbillon. The $750,000 timepiece, one of 30 released in 2015, features three rollers towards the top of the face. Each is engraved with a phrase, allowing for multiple erotic messages, including let me, I long to, I need to, explore, taste, kiss, arouse, you tonight, your lips, your nipples. Drake seems to even own a queen watch. In fact, the watch was said to be worn by Queen Elizabeth II in 1984. Although, unlike the more traditional model, Drake's is rumored to have left the factory with 36 diamonds fastened to the bezel. I mean, really though, what else would you expect from the certified lover boy himself? 
Here's a look at the boys RM56, a wild one. It was the world's first production watch with a sapphire crystal case, when it was introduced in 2012. Drake's version features a decimeter, and clear crown band done up in a rich midnight blue, that matches the coat he's wearing. The price of it? Around the $5 million. Richard Mill is the cream of the cream, and to celebrate his uncountable winnings in rap, he added an insane Richard Mill RM27204, manual winding tour beyond Raphael Nadal, worth as much as $3.2 million. The watch is one of a number of signature models produced by Richard Mill, for the legendary 20-time Grand Slam winning tennis player Rafael Nadal. Nadal's RM models are some of the brand's most popular. Of course, Drake owns an immense number of other watches. But these were his most special editions. We go on now with his rings, because yes, he owns some crazy ones. To start off he has not one, but two NBA championship rings, despite never having played a single second of professional basketball in his entire life. Having received a lot of hate, the piece, designed by Drizzy and celebrity jeweler Jason of Beverly Hills, the ring is said to feature more diamonds than any other championship ring in NBA history, at a ridiculous 30 carats. As of the price, $150,000 each. Continuing to put together some of the most unique premium jewelry, jeweler Alex Moss of Alex Moss New York, recently crafted a special ring for Drake. Valued at $77,000 US dollars, the lucky number 11 ring made specially for Drake, is fittingly centered around an owl motif base, proudly in front of the number 11. After receiving his lucky number 11 ring, Drake went for an extravagant new ring. The ring gets its name from its unusually large size brought on by the massive stones used in its construction. The Godfather ring is made fully in 18K white gold, and set with VVS natural oval diamonds all over, with a larger stone at the center. Drake is showering himself with expensive gifts for his 33rd birthday, dropping more than $750,000 for a custom diamond ring in the shape of a heart. He purchased the 22 karat, heart-shaped diamond ring from Gemma Fine Jewelry as a B-Day present to himself, and the piece is valued between $600,000 and $800,000. Lastly, Drizzy owns a pair of grills too. The rapper hit up celeb jeweler Ben Buller, to make his grills less than 4 days before he shot the In My Feelings music vid in New Orleans. The grills were made in 36 hours, and flown directly there. His order called for a specific combo too, pure platinum and 18k gold. For this little purchase, for him, he paid $14,000. That was for Drake's jewelry collection. He definitely owns some of the craziest, most serious and luxurious pieces in the game. His collection is valued at more than $30 million. Wild. Thank you so much for watching, and of course, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And